This captivating scene was captured on camera, showcasing a remarkable act of kindness by a wild orangutan towards a man trapped in muddy terrain. The touching gesture is bound to warm your heart. Some individuals hold the belief that animals lack emotional depth and do not comprehend concepts such as concern, nervousness, or the instinct to help another creature in distress. However, when this particular moment unfolded between a ranger and a wild orangutan, captured on camera, it challenged such notions and revealed the remarkable qualities of these fascinating beings. Anil Prabhakar, an Indonesian photographer and photojournalist, has long been enthralled by the power of photography to encapsulate a fleeting moment and immortalize it in a single frame. From a young age, Anil's passion for photography was ignited when he received a modest film camera as a birthday gift. Ever since that moment, his fascination with the art form grew, discovering the ability to transform the ordinary into something extraordinary through the lens of his camera. As the years passed, Anil's passion for photography continued to flourish, and he seized every opportunity to capture captivating moments with his digital camera. In 2020, he embarked on a much-anticipated safari alongside his friends. After discussing it for quite some time, they finally made the decision to venture into a specific region of the protected forest in Borneo, with hopes of encountering the elusive wild orangutan in its natural environment. Upon their arrival in Borneo, the group eagerly anticipated their journey through the forest. Anil, armed with his reliable camera, was ready to seize the opportunity to photograph every captivating sight that crossed their path. Little did he know that he was about to capture an extraordinary image that would leave a lasting impression. While exploring the dense jungle, Anil and his friends encountered a warden affiliated with the Borneo Orangutan Survival Foundation, BOSF, a non-profit organization established in 1991. With over 400 dedicated employees, BOSF's mission revolves around safeguarding the orangutan's habitat, which is under constant threat due to rapid deforestation. At the time of this story, the organization had documented more than 650 orangutans residing within their sanctuary or the protected areas of the forest. The wardens, through their diligent efforts, ensure the well-being of these remarkable creatures by preserving their natural habitat. In doing so, they also protect a diverse array of plant and animal species. Safeguarding the forest habitat is of paramount importance not just for wildlife but also for the harmonious coexistence of humans and nature. According to the Foundation's website, Anil and his friends encountered a warden who was waist-deep in water, which left Anil curious about the warden's activity. The warden explained that the waterhole was frequented by orangutans, but snakes posed a significant threat to these primates. To ensure the safety of the orangutans and encourage them to use the waterhole without fear, the warden was clearing the area of snakes. Borneo's tropical rainforests are home to around 160 snake species, many of which pose a serious danger to orangutans. To protect these magnificent creatures, the organization's dedicated workers diligently work to clear rivers of snakes, minimizing the risk of accidental bites. Additionally, the wardens employ a unique technique to raise the orangutans' awareness of their surroundings and the potential dangers they may encounter. They use fake toy snakes as a means to instill fear in the apes, teaching them that real snakes are hazardous. This helps the orangutans understand that caution is necessary to avoid harm. While the warden was engrossed in his work, something extraordinary occurred. It seemed that someone had alerted him to the presence of a snake in the river. Acting promptly, the warden cleared the surrounding bushes, and to his surprise, an orangutan appeared on the riverbanks, attentively observing his actions. The remarkable encounter continued as the orangutan inched closer to the water's edge, extending its hand. Anil described the orangutan's actions as a display of curiosity towards the ranger's activities and a concern for his safety, given the presence of snakes in the water. It was an unexpected and heartwarming moment, capturing the essence of compassion between two different species. Anil, the photographer, expressed his emotional response to witnessing and capturing this extraordinary scene. 
Dr. Jamar Tan Sihai, the chief executive officer of BOSF, confirmed that the moment occurred at one of their facilities, specifically on island number 6, where a 25-year-old female orangutan named Ani resides. Despite the orangutan's seemingly kind and helpful gesture, the warden chose not to accept its hand, deciding to move away instead. When Anil inquired about the warden's response, he explained that as wild animals, the wardens avoid interacting with orangutans to maintain their wariness of humans and potential threats, such as poachers. Anil managed to immortalize the profound moment through his camera lens, highlighting the bridge of compassion that appeared to connect these two species. However, Dr. Jamarudin clarified that the man in the water, Mr. Sayarul, was an employee who had known Ani since the 1990s. Ani had been brought to the sanctuary as a baby after being separated from her mother in the wild. This context adds depth to the relationship between the warden and the orangutan, demonstrating a history of familiarity and care. An alternate interpretation of the scene suggests that Ani, the orangutan, may have been seeking food from Mr. Sayrol rather than offering help. This behavior indicates a level of dependency on humans. The director of BOSF explained that Island No. 6 is a sanctuary for rescued orangutans that cannot be released back into the wild. The area is surrounded by water-filled trenches to create an island environment. Ani resides there with another orangutan named Romeo, who was rescued in Taiwan. The space they inhabit is approximately 1 hectare, 2.5 acres. Unfortunately, due to being separated from their mothers at a young age, these two orangutans have lost the necessary survival skills to live in the wild. They have come to rely on humans for food. By providing them with an island habitat, BOSF aims to offer an environment that closely resembles their original habitat while also ensuring their well-being. Nevertheless, the image captured by Anil struck a chord with people worldwide. It served as a powerful reminder that these remarkable apes possess high intelligence and emotional development, surpassing initial assumptions. The photograph gained significant traction after being shared online, resonating deeply with viewers. The photograph quickly gained viral attention, amassing over 90,000 views on Anil's Instagram account alone. Anil captioned the image with a thought-provoking message, Let me help you, once humanity dies in mankind, sometimes animals are guiding us back to our basics. News agencies worldwide, from the BBC in the UK to CNN, picked up the story, captivated by the extraordinary moment captured between these two species. National Geographic even featured the image on the front cover of their magazine, emphasizing the remarkable similarities between humans and animals and the need for us to reconnect with our natural roots to heal the planet rather than harm it. Whether the orangutan was seeking food or genuinely trying to assist the man out of the water, Anil's photograph serves as a testament to the awe-inspiring nature of these creatures and offers hope for a future where humans and animals can coexist harmoniously. It's truly an incredible story. Feel free to share your thoughts in the comments below and remember to like and subscribe for more captivating tales, this is an accident that caused a sensation in the UK. A five-year-old boy fell into the territory of a chimpanzee, and the chimpanzees surrounded him. On that day, when the zoo had just opened, the originally cheerful tourists suddenly let out a scream. A five-year-old boy accidentally fell into a chimpanzee fence several meters deep. The little boy fell into a brief coma, and the nearby chimpanzees immediately gathered around him. Seeing this situation, the people above were so anxious that they didn't know what to do. At this moment, a tall chimpanzee approached and reached out to the little boy, which scared the onlookers into a cold sweat, however, unexpectedly, it only gently caressed the boy's back, as if to awaken him and silently guard beside him. Perhaps the crowd's voice was too loud, and several other orangutans in the garden also gathered. The chimpanzee who was originally guarding the boy's side. Surprisingly, he roared at them to prevent them from continuing to approach the boy. After a while, the boy gradually regained consciousness in the pain, and as soon as he opened his eyes, 
he saw the chimpanzee lying horizontally in front of him. He was so scared that Howling Tao burst into tears. Upon seeing this, the gorilla quickly withdrew for a distance. The keepers in the other side of the park also launched rescue efforts, only to see the keepers jump into the park and rush to the boy's side. At this moment, an incredible scene appeared again. The chimpanzees were afraid that other chimpanzees would come out and harm them, so they drove all the chimpanzees into a small room and left rescue space for the keepers. Shortly after, the boy was rescued by the keeper, but fortunately he was only slightly injured and not seriously ill. Unfortunately, six years later, this chimpanzee passed away due to illness. In commemoration of his heroic deeds, the zoo made him a bronze statue in his honor, and even invited the boy who was rescued to cut the ribbon for him. Now the boy has grown up and has two children of his own. But he still couldn't forget that day. The boy had always regarded it as a turning point in his life, and it was the help provided by chimpanzees that made him particularly passionate about animals. Now he plans to wait for his children to grow up a little bit and take them back to the zoo, telling them the story of being rescued by a gorilla. Although some animals may look fierce, they also have a gentle and kind side.